All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Nick. As always, Tetra Ninja, all that good stuff. We are once again back playing some Days Gone. So, in the last episode, we learned that the Rippers are actually another faction that we kind of pissed off. So, gonna, we're still waiting for the blowback on that. But right now, we need to do more. More. There's always more. More missions for the Iron Lake. Not Iron Lake. The Lakeside Camp. And that continues with this mission from Riki Patel. Sounds like a Indian last name. Thinking along the lines of a Patel. But anyways, Patel's like the Smith of Indian last names. But all right. Hey, Ricky, you said you had a job for me? Hey, Deke. Yeah. You remember Shane Riley? Everyone called him Red. Red Riley. Yeah, never heard of him. But let me guess. Ginger? What? Red hair? No. It was his boots. He wore these rattlesnake boots dyed with god-awful red color. He made quite the impression. <laughs> no, I bet. Anyway, he used to do runs for us back in the day until one day he decides he didn't like the camp credits we were paying. So he up and kills Lindsay Fuller. Who? Lindsay. Worked supply before Blair. Wait a second, so he killed an unarmed woman? Oh, she was armed. She just wasn't expecting him to shoot her in the face. Will you listen? So Red murders her, cleans out her supply hut, and then takes off before anyone knows what's happened. Got away clean. Oh, that son of a bitch. Until now. He and his men have been spotted up at Camp Pioneer. You don't gotta ask. I, uh, he got this thing about him. About killing unarmed women. I know. So I knew you'd want to handle it. Yeah, like I said, I got this covered. Um, what else can you tell me about him? Not much. Oh, wait. He chews tobacco. I heard he was such an addict that he rounds up cigarette butts takes out the tobacco and chews that. Well, that's disgusting. So now I got two reasons to kill him. Yeah, but be careful, Deke. With this machine gun on my back? I don't need to be careful, baby. Where are you? Long way around, eh? Must say, must say, my bike is getting pretty baller. Kinda, it's kind of depressing because we're just moving. Uh, I hate it when games give you like either the full Monty of what you get, like a, like the full bike or upgraded bike at the beginning of the game, or in RPG cases they give you like the character or full power just to rip it away at the start of the game, and then they they make you re-earn it all over again. It's kind of. Like, in my opinion, that's a little bit of a cock tease, but that's not how I would do it. I would like. It's the old yeah. saying that there. ignorance is bliss. Deke and St. John, the Lost Lake Infirmary. Come back. Deke! Hey. Uh, feeling a lot of it, you know. You okay? What's going on? Boozer. Hey. Uh, nothing. I, uh. Tired of listening to the radio free Oregon. You know, he takes so much of his truth or bullshit, you know? Deke, uh, Eddie told me how I'd be dead if I were for you. Getting the NI, whatever the fuck's. Boozer, I, uh, it must have been fun. Hold me down while she fucking whacked away at me. <laughs> Remember how, uh, Jack carved up that turkey last time we was all together. <laughs> hey, Ricky, I'm a camp pioneer and it is a goddamn war zone. What's going on? Are any of our guys there? Uh, no, I don't think so. Sounds like they're clear. Holy oh, fuck. Who's a clone back now? <laughs> this reticle is so massive. No, I don't think so. Sounds like they're clearing freaks. Uh, don't worry. I'll find this guy. Deacon out. All right, Red. Where the hell are you? Okay, yes, yes. Cigarette butts, yes. I've been here before. Used all my grenades. Hot dang. This MG machine gun, though, is gonna be legit. 
Never have to reload again. What's up, dudes? Heal! Just because you see me don't mean you can kill me! Sniped! Yeah, long distance is not the game with this gun. But you just gotta feather it, you know? Just feather it. Wow. Shoot me in the back, why don't you? Three bullets, all it takes, baby. Make it. I need this. Ah, that's tobacco spit. Right, finally, you are one gross motherfucker. I may swap it out because I don't feel like there's a ne necessarily need two machine guns or two automatic weapons. Wooden box. What's in here? More blueprints. Damn, newts. I hear a bike. Freaks. Freaks. I got you. Freaks. Oh. Every shot. Oh. Get the bastard. We killed him. Oh, you bet I did. <laughs> Motherfucker. Get after him. Oh, there he is. How's your armor now, bitch? Oh. Man, this thing's so beastly! Hey, my bike. Oh, I bike. Not my bike. Could use some of that scrap metal business. Scrap. Delicious scrap. Delicious. More bounties. Oh, good. You're in. Oh, God. That scared the shit out of me. You gotta go. You gotta go. Wow. Good night. Sit down. You got Pepe on your boots. Pepe. Hi. You're a little bit late, dude. Come on out. I 
got those keys. You eat this asshole. <laughs> nice toss, asshole. That's one of my tosses. Blue your sail up. Rags. Look, see around here. Check out the kitchen before I head up the stairs. Pantries just ravaged. Just ravaged. Okay, I have the keys. What do you want me to do with the keys? Search the cabins. Sons of bitches. Take it. So good. Mosby here with the red boots. I want one of me those red helmets these guys are rocking. Straight up Fortnite style. Oof, that was close. I almost butchered that. So loud. So loud. Fast travel back. It's snowing again. <laughs> Running off fumes. It's a drifter, let him in. It's not good for the engine. No trouble, okay? No trouble, no trouble. Hey there. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, good. Uh, good choice. Yep. See you around. Yep. Hey, hey, Ricky. I got him. Deacon, what a relief. Lindsay has some folks she was close to. I'll let him know. Yeah, okay. I'll see you around, Ricky.
buried rivers. Alright, now that we have the machine gun, I'm gonna swap out this submachine gun. What's going on, gun. Four. Um... I am gonna say... Should we try the M14? Why not? No refunds on that, just so you know. Wow. Is this thing, thing going to blow up in my hand? Okay. Uh, you would come back soon, huh? Can I buy the satchel for this? How's it going? Hey, how's life? Ugh, damn it. Boo! Fill her up. Okay. Later. They tore. I've been uh, thinking about what you were saying about doing something to make a difference around here, pay back the camp. I'm listening. Do you got a few minutes? I want to show you something. Yeah, guess I can spare you a minute or two. So generous with your time. So where are we heading? You ever been out to the caves north of the lake? I know. Come on, see if you can keep up. Okay, let's go. Why are we walking? Oh my god, I can't even use this weapon. I got march duty anyway this morning. Gotta see if any freaks are stuck in the muck out that way. When's the last time you went up there? Been a few years, I guess. When I was a boy, we used to live in that damn cave. My old man sort of fancied himself a geologist. Sounds like we got a couple. Freaks stuck in the mud, I mean. Oh, I can't use weapons. Yeah, sounds like. Here, let me take care of them. All right. I guess I can let you do that. <laughs> the heck? Fish in a barrel. Nice work. I think Schizo's just found a new man for the job. You know what Schizo can go do. Anyway, as I was saying, we spent hours talking about how all these caves were formed when lava flows would harden on the outside, but the molten cores would still flow like buried rivers. You got the big caves that drew in the tourists, like Metolius up there. There's way more than that. Riddled all over these parts. Okay, okay, we're coming up on the highway. We gotta be quiet. A big horde. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <clears throat> this is why you brought me out of here? Smell a bunch of goddamn freaks? Yeah. Okay, okay. Come on, follow him. Wait, wait, wait. Follow him? Where the hell are we going? You'll see. Come on. <sighs> Don't get too close. Stay down. Jesus, that's a lot of guys. What the hell are we doing, Deke? This doesn't seem all that smart, even for a goddamn drifter. Hold up, hold up. You remember telling me about how the tourists used to flood up from California in the summer, choke off Highway 97 and the I-5 freeway? Yeah, in July, folks smelled almost as bad as these here freaks. Well, you weren't wrong about one thing. These freaks, the big groups, the ones that some call hordes, I think they're the reason we can't get their numbers down. What do you mean? 
Think about it, man. I've been out here in the shit collecting bounties for more than a year. Boozer too. Ricky and Schizo, a few others. How many freaks you think I killed? A few. A few. Yeah, but their numbers never go down. You got a point? It's these whores. Every night, there's a steady stream of them up and down the Sandium Highway. Thousands of freaks pouring into the Lost Lake Valley, north of the Cascades. And you think they're coming up from California? Highway's closed off. No one's been south of the Santium Pass in years. It's not closed off to the hordes. Freaks are the reason it's closed off. Anyway, the point I'm trying to make is that the hordes come in every night. Not a goddamn thing we can do to stop them. Well, you got that much right. Lost more than a few men trying to back in the day. Yeah, I know. I was there. And every horde that comes through leaves a few stragglers or gets busted up and scatters and, and just like that, freaks everywhere as far as the eye can see. Got a bottle that the man cut them off at the source. <clears throat> yeah, we don't, you don't need to see them to know that they're around. We figure out a way to stop the hordes coming through. Maybe we can make some headway, reduce their numbers. Make it safer. Free up more farmland, irrigation. Yeah. Okay, so how do we do that? You know goddamn well you can't take on a, a, a whatever you call it, a, a horde? I need these. This is how. I'll be goddamn. Yeah. They stay in there all day, hibernating or whatever the hell freaks do. So what are you thinking that we... Yep. We blow it the hell up. Stick it down to my there, there, and there. We'll bring down a mountain of rock. We seal this shit up. Yeah, so we trap a few hundred inside. What good is that gonna no, do? No, no, you don't get it. We seal this cave. Maybe they don't got no place to sleep. Or maybe this trail of piss and shit dries out, goes stale, and others stop coming. You get my attention. Okay, come on, let's head back. All right, my knees are warmed up a bit. Let's see if you can keep up. Yeah, okay. Tell me, when does being out in the shit make you an expert on freaks? You spend your spare time just following them around, seeing what makes them tick? Not exactly. And how do you know about all this? About what a horde's gonna do, where they sleep? A few days ago, I was riding north of Belknap Crater when a chopper flew by. A chopper? What the hell? Just listen to me. It was a black chopper. One of those Nero choppers that used to fly all over the goddamn place when the shit was going down. And you saw one? Still flying? I followed him. I stole one of their radios. I've been trying to track him down, see if they have a base around here. Supplies. Shit, I mean, see if the feds are still alive. You know what I'm saying? They're out here doing field work of some kind on the freaks. They're studying them. They got resources to do that, while we're out here starving, fighting to stay alive. I followed them up to the Grotto Caves. You know the ones? Yeah. They have motion sensors set up, measuring how many freaks use the cave during the day, and, uh, Mike, it was thousands. That right. Never they said freaks all up and down the Cascade Range, south of Crater Lake and north up to Smith Rock, all use these lava tube caves to hibernate. So, we blow up those caves, maybe we have a few less to deal with. Walking over a zombie corpse. Never a good idea. Hey, this idea of yours, it's got some merit, but job like that it's gonna take a fair amount of TNT he said you wanted help making Lost Lake safer this is how we do it uh, 
<sighs> All right. All right, look. There's some things I gotta do, okay? But you meet me at the bridge in a couple of minutes. I know where we can find some. Oh, baby. Give me that to your tea. Say, John. He was supposed to be up at the farm an hour ago. My guy said he's got a shovel waiting for you. Yeah, Schizo, about that, I'm busy. See, Iron Mike and I, we're just heading out on a run. You and Iron Mike? You'll get your ass up that way today, or you and your gimp boyfriend are gonna find yourselves out in the shit. You hear me? Without a goddamn battle. Yeah, yeah, I'll get right on that. St. John out. Schizo doesn't like that we're working with Iron Mike. Nope. Invading his territory here. Skills. We unlocked another branch, didn't we? I thought we did. Ah, oh, the iron grip. Works for me every time I use it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. As always, if you enjoyed, thumbs up or appreciate it. And we will check with you guys next time where we continue building up Lost Lake in Days Gone, right? As always, have a fantastic day.